As I understand, Warren was asked a couple months ago, would you be interested? He said, at the right price. Well, Warren Buffett, in my experience, says at the right price, he'll invest in just about anything. <laughs> yeah, exactly, <laughs> which is what, I mean, there's no real reason to think that now is the time that Warren Buffett's going to get involved in this. And he was asked about this, and it was also sort of in the context of buying businesses from GE. And he seemed, you know, asked on CNBC, would you be interested in buying some of these divisions that GE is looking to sell? To me, that's a more plausible scenario. Yeah, give me one good reason why he'd invest in GE, having divested a shed load already. I, I have no idea. But, but, but what, well, what divisions, well, there's been a lot of talk about possibly breaking mm. up General Electric and selling off some of the more valuable parts. But, but what parts would Warren Buffett be involved in? I don't think of him sort of being in medical science particularly. He doesn't do a lot of medical equipment. No, I mean, they do have this health venture that they're starting with uh, yes. J.P. Morgan's Jamie Dimon with uh, Jeff Bezos of Amazon. He has said he would not be interested in the healthcare unit as part of that venture. But, you know, anything at the right price, the healthcare unit throws off a lot of cash. I don't know that GE would really want to get rid of all of its healthcare business, given that it is such a strong cash flow generator. Generator, the businesses that they've been sort of marked for divestiture have been locomotives, some sort of smaller, like the industrial solutions well, business. He does own a railroad. He yes. Owns a railroad. Yes, he does, you know, and that's been one that's sort of flagged as maybe something that could be interesting. But then you get into: Are there antitrust issues? Are there problems oh. with other customers? You know, if you have Burlington Railroad owning a major producer of locomotive engines, are you still going to be able to sell those engines to other railroads? So that's also not very clear to me is how Warren Buffett buys a major division of GE, although not impossible. So to go back to the bigger picture question here about whether or not he'd look to buy GE overall, I just think given the, the skeletons in the closet, the big review that we saw, and then the announcement with the insurance concerns, I mean, who knows what they do in terms of asset sales, but people saying that $20 billion isn't enough. I mean, you've been through this many times with us. Why, at this stage, do you trust buying the broader business? I don't know that I do, and that's what makes me very skeptical of the fact that Warren Buffett or really any sort of big investor could get comfortable with the liabilities here because there's so much risk and so much unknown. I mean, yes. I think what we really saw with that charge of GE Capital is that this is still such a black box. So many years after the financial crisis, after so much has been sold off, there are still these massive liabilities that nobody really has a clear handle on.